listeners, as you know, we were really engrossed in some more complex body dropping history than we initially bargained for last week. This is the second half of that recording, and next week we will pick up with part two. Thanks, guys. Enjoy. Okay, so you've got more wine. <laughs> yes. <laughs> whatever, whatever the reason. Thank you have, for the intermission. <laughs> we have... Um, we have done what we're <laughs> what we're here to do with the Crimea and all the more that we just intend to talk about it. Yes. Apparently, yes. So I'm sorry, I gave you a heads up that I wanted to do my um, web of family tree history of a Roman Oz. <laughs> God, we aren't even there yet. <laughs> that's, that's, I know, that's, that's I hard. know. This is what's crazy. Okay, here we go. <sighs> All right. Okay, so we left off. Yes, I know where we are. Okay, here we go. I know. We 15. needed an intermission. That or we were going to like start screaming at each other about <laughs> nonsense. I don't understand, damn it. <laughs> we were going to start screaming each other or at each other about VP and we already agreed we weren't going to do that because neither yeah. one of us wants to be in the hospital. Or really no, or talk about current occupation of the Crimea. It is what it yeah, is. Exactly. Well, it is what it is. When we do these, this is the reality. We didn't do a run through this time. This is exactly what it is. <laughs> we didn't answer questions. We're just Take living in the moment. It. Take, take it or leave, it. leave it. We understand if you leave it. We prefer you take it. But we understand. I mean, it makes us feel better when other people understand our crazy. <laughs> I don't even want to talk about this anymore, but we have to. Have to. Okay, because I want to know. I've got this family tree and everything. So Because next week we have to talk about it more. <laughs> okay. 1553. Yvonne the Terrible falls ill and I mean like really ill like sicky sick Mick Sickerson I guess you would say so hmm. um, there, coincidence? I mean who knows Let's like see. we said there's who knows? just Cusco's okay, poison so. is everywhere in the kingdom <laughs> I'm literally oh my god this is what I'm saying I'm literally <laughs> writing Cusco's poison I'm in my please, family tree please Take a picture of these notes and oh, post God. it for Twitter because oh. in my head, they are amazing because it's just been me yelling a lot and you writing things down at this point. It's a lot of misspe misspelled words and arrows and pointing and uh, um, not complete. I've got Theodore arrow fiodor slash <laughs> um frodo like i have it written down like it is there and with an arrow that points upward to ivan which is ivan the the and theodore which prospers which bsc which is the Saint, you know, Basil's Cathedral. That's what I wrote, which is Siberia fight with the pole ho hose. And you told me I couldn't <laughs> see that reference anymore. So now I have this huge X across my notes. So if you need to take a picture, we will probably get in more trouble. We've already recording. said it at okay. this point, and I'm not taking it back. You know I'm I don't take it back. Heads up. If you want me to take a picture of these notes, I'm not sure. I'm not sure you want me to. Uh, okay. <laughs> so oh we are in God. 15 of 53. <laughs> I'm in the terrible is ill. <laughs> okay. Got a real bad fever and no, with Cusco's poison. With okay. possibly Cusco poison. Who knows? <laughs> the poison for Cusco. Cusco's poison. The poison. The cool Cusco. That poison. 
Yes. Who's that poison? Oh, I'm <laughs> crying, and I apologize to anybody Russian of Russian descent <laughs> that is listening to this right now. This is just an open-ended blanket discussion. apology for all of Russia. <laughs> it's to make me feel better at night. Okay, I'm sorry. It's all right, Bethany. If you're asking the question, the audience doesn't know the answer either. That is why we do this podcast. Here, here. Cheers. I wish you could clink with my wine glass right now. I am. I have clinked so hard just now in spirit. Oh, you clink so hard, you dirty girl. Guys, I got so... I got so weird and so mad about it. I had to stop and have a drink to keep going. (laughs) Because... (laughs) See, if you were not okay with my brand of crazy, we would just, like, never be here, so... Um, your brand of crazy <laughs> somehow <laughs> equals my brand of understanding <laughs> crazy. I'm sorry, I may have to take my oh, inhaler. Wait. I'm laughing so hard right now about, <laughs> <Nerd. Yeah. laughs> about screaming about the Crimea on both on both a 1500s and a modern 2009 <laughs> map. Oh my God. The fact that we can talk about the 50, we're about to talk about the 1500s <laughs> and related to the 2019s is pretty. I'm sorry, oh I'm taking an A alert. I'm nerd. <laughs> All the All cool of- kids have oxygen pipes. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, no. Oh my god, please cut that one out. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I am seriously crying. None right of it's now. getting cut out at this point, oh, no. Bethany. We've had a non air fight about the crying <laughs> at. <laughs> it's back to episode two of Body Count Unedited. <laughs> Oh my god. We don't even know if it's gonna be an episode two. It's gonna have to be. This is just too long. Oh, this is just where we're god. at. <laughs> we haven't done this in a while, you can tell. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, and I thought this would just be such an easy little romp through history. <laughs> How wrong I am. It's very oh. rare when you're wrong, but I actually when I read it, I told you, didn't I? I said, hey heads up yeah, when we you... start recording let's just let it be as it's be, as it is <laughs> you know that uh, my my litigious self I only take in about a quarter of the things said to me and process what's in writing that's about it that is about it. you went on this tangent in the outline um, and I'm sorry but I was like bitch back up Okay. <laughs> um, I'm glad you get it, but I don't. Oh, you have got me in the spirit of what we're talking about. You literally, you literally have me right now downing vodka as if yeah, this is Soviet era Russia. <laughs> Just that's how you survive shit. in Russia back then in the 1500s. Oh, <laughs> this is how you survive talking about Russia in the 15. <laughs> Dear God. Okay, 1553. Ivan is ill. May or may not be yes. poison. We don't know. Answer? <laughs> Probably. Probably. Answer Anastasia Romanov. Anastasia. Anas- Anastasia. Such a sexy okay. name. Romanov's brother, Nikita. Oh, brother. Yeah, her so brother, brother. Her brother, so brother in law to the terrible. Nikita Romanov, who. Oh, okay, okay. Tried... So, you, sorry. So, okay. I've. No, no, I've... keep going. Okay. Ivan's real you're sick, ahead. right? So, he tries yes. to get all of the court to go ahead and swear allegiance to the eldest of the Terrible's sons, who is a baby at the time. Okay, okay, which is 
the the baby is Anastasia, right? Or, or, or the mother of the baby is Anastasia. Anastasia Romanov. So he's okay. Okay. Half okay. Her kid, half half Romanov. Romanov. Okay. Okay. I'm so calling. Nikita's like pushing for his nephew, right? But here's the thing. Oh, good. Good uncle. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Okay. Um, except for all of the court refuses. <laughs> Favoring, uh, well, because like King Baby well, I guess never makes baby. Her, yeah, King Baby mm-hmm. historically speaking never goes well. <laughs> it's, not a, it's not a like secure position. Yes, he can grow into it, but what are we gonna do in the meantime? I get it. Okay, exactly. It's baby. Then it's Court refuses then it's for it's baby. I get it. Then everybody's going to start fighting again because King Baby can't keep them all alive. It shows, it shows that it's it's weak. And now we have a weak system because uh-huh. who's the next heir, a.k.a. Baby. And I thought uh-huh. you weren't learning a damn thing through this whole thing. <laughs> and I'm going to bow, or no, curtsy. <laughs> I wish you could video see me right I'm now. Taking like, a, I, am, I am taking, I am toasting you right now. Like, everybody, <laughs> pray stand and charge your glasses. For Bethany here. has indeed listened. Yeah, here, a podcast that actually makes um, the incoherent understand and learn. And amen. I just love how completely (laughs) off the freaking rails this is gone. And I'm just rolling with it at this point. So, yes, they refuse. Who do they who do they favor? Yvonne, the terrible's adult cousin, Prince Vladimir of Starista or Starista. Hold on. Zarista. This Sir, name, uh, oh, I see Starista, but uh, but then again, no, it's knows? Staritza. That's how you say Star, it. Star, Star, Star. Of course, because it's fucking Russian. Um, sorry, but so I've Ivan's adult cousin, who is what relation to Anastasia or Nikita? None whatsoever. Not okay. So obviously, so the Romanovs are taking a bit of an issue with this because, of course, they want you know King Babies related to them. They want some King Baby action. They like to keep it in the family. You know what? It's a reoccurring factor that I learned way back in during our deep dive with Edward. You no, know, I th- exactly. I get it. No, I and I'm just trying to make. Sh- that I Who understand. Do you think is gonna control King Baby, but mommy and uncle, mommy and uncle, or some sort of advisor. Yeah, they'll be in basically. Some they'll be military. Edna, something. They'll be. Yeah, they'll be running the kingdom till King Baby's like sixteen. Exactly. Considered ha- a man because that literally have his fucking life. No, no, no. I get it. Okay. Uh-huh. Exactly. But Star and babies. shit's about to go off the rails. So everybody and... get ready for the body counting portion of this story. Because unlucky for everybody who's been pre-playing their hands, Yvonne okay. the Terrible survives. <laughs> oh, oh shit, because he's yeah. dying, wasn't he? He yeah. was sick. He he had he had some sort of well, I feel like this is like paparazzi one on one. We're broken up, but no, we're not really. We just really want the attention attention and, and people to talk about us until we approve it. I feel like this is it. This is totally play on like social media. This is totally a history. Yeah, of exactly. Happening. Exactly. But you also have to remember, he's already, and it may have been, he was already distrustful of all these people because of his problems with the Polish war going on, right? He's never been honest he's from never, the beginning. Yeah, he's never really trusted him. Um, but Sorry, not he honest, emerges but, yeah. Thank very you. much alive, <laughs> very much well, and who boy is he... 
Um, Kicking ass and taking names. <laughs> yeah, but not only that, not only does he he come out of like his four poster hanging bed super pissed off, but he also emerges from his illness, uh, for lack of a better term, crazy as a fucking loon. <laughs> like okay, I don't know so how to put it. So then does that mean he actually was cured of the so-called illness he had or he just had a side effect or? You know, they don't know. I mean, they didn't know enough then <sighs> and they didn't really like write down in detail okay. medical journals. It okay, could fair, be that fair. is, you know, it could be he got a fever at some point that was so high it boiled his brain a little bit. We don't know. But he comes out, he was always volatile and manic, but now he- Yeah, he didn't like the rumors. He was like, oh, hell motherfucking no. Yeah, no, I get it. And everything going on, he is now completely certifiable. And not only is he certifiable, he is out for revenge against his not so loyal to the family, nobility, and boyers. Oh. Well, didn't they just try to replace him or didn't have a... Well, I mean, think about it. Do you want to have a go? Do you want to have a go at somebody named Yvonne the Terrible? (laughs) But, I mean, hold on. Okay, I get that. However, everybody, like you made a point earlier, but I don't want to come for him. Okay, 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 Jessica, I get that. However, but you made a point of like, that's why I did the Google search earlier or episode, previous, whatever it may be. I'm just saying is, did they pick that name for themselves or was it bestowed upon them? Okay, just because my daddy is called Yvonne the Terrible doesn't mean I'm going to follow in his footsteps. Well, I mean, he might. Well, his I mean, dad was the great, and he he's keyed up to go the opposite his nerve, direction. The, the terrible, like, I oh, fuck you, dad. I'm I mean, I don't doubt I mean, I'm just it, saying. Maybe he did get the name afterward. That yeah. Name, but, okay. but. I'm sorry, I'm just gonna. Just, like, wake up and go. You know what? I am the terrible today. He's been dead a day, and I feel like he should be the terrible. Oh, my God. I've had a great idea. (laughs) This is what we should do, okay? I feel like if you are immediately (laughs) referred to as Ivan the Terrible, even even (laughs) after your death, you've you've already... Laid down the groundwork your entire life. <laughs> I be would either be like, big of a fuck dick. this. I, I honestly, Jessica, if if all of a sudden I came across the fact that like my name was considered in history books as Yvonne the fucking terrible, <laughs> I mean, might as well put the F word before it because gosh darn it, especially when you come from a history of lines of where your daddy or no wait, your great grand. You know what I mean? He's probably he's the third, right? Isn't he the third of some long history? He's the fourth. Of, uh, okay, okay. Thank you, thank you. Well, actually, thank actually, you, well, actually. Okay, Captain <laughs> Fucking Obvious. Thank you. Okay, but what I'm trying to get at, bitch, is the fact that he comes from this perceptive thing where he has to follow these you know rules and guidelines and he's like this shit I ain't doing none of that I'm gonna make my own name terrible fuck it let's go for it I'm gonna be as terrible as can be oh my god oh my god God. this is why you do run throughs I'm like, just saying. I told you I had so right, many you know battles. I will accede to that. Prove me right. wrong. I, I will. I will take your point because I can't prove you wrong. But if they yeah. ever invent okay. a time machine, I think we both know where we're going. Go. <laughs> we're going to 1554 and so. Are you calling Listen, this guy yeah. the terrible yet? Just out I of mean, curiosity? 
<laughs> what the fuck have you been doing, motherfucker? And what happened to the two, <laughs> three, and, f- you know, before the four happened? Who, what the fuck were they <sighs> called? Okay. Oh, God. <laughs> so, Figure it out. God damn it. <laughs> the point is, for a couple years, they put up with some, maybe some, you know, harshness and ill treatment from him but then something else yeah. happens 1560 and say what you will about the man his beloved seven years. because he was seven years old. he was super yeah. into his first wife let's all remember that anastasia, right? yeah. anastasia romanoff dies <laughs> no and what's more fun <sighs> is she may have been poisoned. Now she may not have been. They actually no! here's, here's a fun fact. They actually exhumed her body and tested. She did have what? unusually high amounts of well, they've done it recently, you know, for the posterity. She did have unusually high amounts of mercury present what? in well, the is remains. That from the ground or well, into no. The- that used to be a medicine too in the 1500s. Yeah. They thought oh, you could cure okay. things with can, mercury. Can, yeah. So she may have been ill, and that's the medicine, or somebody mm-hmm. just may have given her a shit ton of mercury. We don't know. But mm. all that does matter is that the terrible is convinced she was poisoned. By no. all his courtiers and magnates, which I mean, he insane. now believes are all enemies. In his mind, well, he has no friend in the kingdom at court, right? Well, I mean, yes, of course, because hello, Jessica, think about it. Look at the past. History doesn't repeat itself, but it sure does ram. I mean, look at this particular thing. I know he's Ivan the 800 millionth. I'm sorry, the fourth. I'll be <laughs> historically correct for you. My bad. But I'm just saying, like, can he not learn from his parent, grandparent, great grandparents' mistakes? Or is this just something we have to figure out 300 years later? Well, I mean, to be fair, they were learning, like, Greek, Latin, and counting, I don't know, things on a, what do you call them, abacus? Is that how you say it? You know those things that the the Chinese invented that you move the little counters to count shit? (laughs) I mean, that's the level of education here, Bethany. I mean, (laughs) what I was. They think mercury cures disease. (laughs) I was thinking of the thing that you push the circles over and under in the little maze at the doctor's office. (laughs) They push it over the circles. Oh, my God. (laughs) That's what I. This is derailed so far. I love it. I, oh. oh my god, my who, who the fuck needs to work out? My ab just gotta work out. Oh yeah, no, mine are burning. I've been doing this for hours. Mine are burning. Oh my god. Oh no, I hope you couldn't hear that. Okay. Oh, I've been snoring the entire time. We're okay. okay. I mean. This is the two little pigs tell the tale of medieval Russia at this point. <laughs> this is why we've broken huh. this down. <laughs> it, it, exactly. Exactly. Whatever the okay. reason, whether she was poisoned so, or not, he believes she is. Regardless, she becomes, she's dead. She's dead. Yeah. So she's he's, real, he's really completely off the rails at this point. He becomes violently obsessed with his defecting because people are getting the hell out of there at this point. They're getting scared. And then also the ones that are still there are doing all kinds of court intrigue, all these nobles and boyars, and then boom, he suddenly ups, vacates Moscow for his like crazy times, private and remote medieval fortress fiefdom. Now remember, the the czar had the most land and nobles had big chunks of land and boyars had big chunks of land, right? But what made... Mm -hmm. Whereas, like, in France, 
and in England, the king didn't have more land than a lot of his nobles. And that's why things were always shaky. That never happens. Oh, okay. In Russia. Okay. He's okay, always okay. like King Tits. So he's got it all together. That makes sense. Okay. I'm right. with you. He's got the duchy there in Moscow that gives him the legitimacy that that's the house that rules. But he also has vast, a huge vast swath of land where there are serfs on it. And whereas serfs weren't owned by nobles and other European countries, they were the property of whoever had whatever in Russia. Does that make okay, sense? Okay, so you, you so, say serfs. What are, what, again, explain to me in a modern term, what are serfs? Um, S-U-R-F-S? Or, okay. S-E-R-F-S. Like, slavery with more steps, basically. No, um... It was peasants that lived on the land. They worked it. Then they paid, they worked the land. They had to grow all their own crops. And then they gave, you know, a bag of grain to pay taxes to whoever their feudal lord was. But okay. in Russia, he, they outright own these people. Like, you couldn't just marry whoever you wanted. He, they or married. Pay back your debt? Could you ever you pay can, back? No, no. 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 Oh shit. Okay. I'm oh, sorry. Shoot. You were a okay. surf there. You were uh, uh, uh that was uh, it. And so this is dang. what he he withdraws to his fiefdom, which is of course, as we know, a huge part of what makes up all of this country at this time. Yes, so, of course. Yeah. He just ups and goes off to this, right? Okay. Then the terrible splits the country into two parts. His okay. personal stronghold area that he's in right now with those that are sworn only to him. Because, of course, he's got the equivalent of, like, knights, retainer, that are under okay. him. So, these people are evil <laughs> bullshit kind right. of thing. Right. These people okay. aren't okay. serfs, but they okay. serve What's his the other house part? only. Everywhere okay. else. <laughs> like, poor and... A mistreated and probably criminals, right? No, just everywhere else that was not this little fiefdom of his, that was not his land, everywhere else was just like other. regardless if they like were born into that. Oh, you're 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 no, it doesn't matter. About that. Below. He's like, no, he doesn't split this fiefdom. I'm talking about the whole country. Oh he my God! Split the whole because country in two parts. Country, I needed to. Sorry, I'm. Remember, I'm taking notes here, so I've got a weird tree. Okay, so two parts with the country. His little elite. Oh, there we go. Elite. Elite. Nice. Okay. Versus everyone else. Yeah, the places he owns versus the whole rest of the country, which other people own, respectively. Yeah. Okay. Which it's like one of those things. Think of the masses. Once you unite the masses, you can overthrow. It doesn't matter because you have to think about it this way. If all the people on his land are owned by him or like the knights are only loyal to him. Let's say we've got the Prince of Dickhedia over here that has his fiefdom. Everybody he, on that um, land is owned by him. By him who supports all, all this the guy. Oh my God. Are owned Fuck. by him. I just threw my pen. Sorry. And so. God damn it. <laughs> if you don't belong to the terrible, I believe you belong to his support. You belong yeah. to his enemy. It doesn't matter if you he's never set eyes on you or if you're just a rando poor person. You belong to his enemy. Point blank. So basically, the people that sword. belong to yeah. him are like property against a prince or a boyer that he hates. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And that's Not- what all the rest of the country is made of. That's gonna. I, I just want to make that Probably. distinction. 
Because Enemy. of what's going to happen. Here for me, quick. number number one. Public Enemy number one. Yeah. Watch the and movie. Since, <laughs> you know, everybody pissed him off. Everybody mm-hmm. is fair game, and therefore everybody that belongs to the nobility or the boyers is also fair game. Right. Because he's yes. thinking because of it he's like paranoid. he's beyond paranoid now. He's beyond paranoid, but also th- this is like property. They own these people. It, it's to him burning the castle is the same as killing all your peasants. It's your property, mm-hmm. and I'm out to get Prince. Everyone's replaceable. Prince Pooh face of Dickadia over here. Exactly. Exactly. Pooh face of Dickadia. <laughs> I'm writing that down right now. Pooh face Dicadia. of Dickadia. You're going to write down all. The... Okay. Okay. We're just we're gonna fly past it. And we're gonna keep fly going. <laughs> So oh, it's at shit. this point, shit then gets real as he Obviously. unleashes his own private army. So all the soldiers, all the 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 knight equivalents, you know, that <clears throat> he knows for facts because they belong to him, are loyal yeah. only to him, releases his own private army. The Oprichniki, Oprichniki, that's it, Oprichniki. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I literally almost died on my wine just then. I'm sorry, but no, bitch, that's not what I see. That is not what I see, what you wrote in this outline you sent me. No, no, and no. That's not how you say it. I'm gonna tell you, I, no, I'm gonna, no, I'm gonna tell you how to say it. This is how okay, is. okay. <laughs> By all means, <laughs> Oprichniki. Okay, oh that's how God. you say it. Oprichniki. Sodbuster version. <laughs> Bam. Done and done. End of story. Correct me if I'm wrong. I don't give a shit. This is what I'm saying. Oprichniki. You're welcome. And continue. Okay. <laughs> <I'm sorry. laughs> Oprah Oprah Whatever. Uh, Whatever loose. Whatever all you want to do with it. Be loose. That's fine. Okay. Which, what these people... <laughs> be loose. <laughs> sorry, I'm, done. I'm done. I'm done. Which, <laughs> what they are is basically like an insane medieval secret police force so it's the ss on on steroids basically (laughs) perfect example i love it it's them (laughs) times you know 10 (laughs) on steroids with the cameras rolling like let's be honest so this group of weird lads dressed all in black (laughs) They rode black horses to which the men in black. Oh God, if only it was that fun. Now to their horses and themselves, they attached brooms, which symbolized their incorruptibility, and dogs' heads symbolizing their ferocious loyalty to Ivan the Terrible. Boo! Boo. So that's, that's just a fun group. I disagree. I disagree. Dog heads equals psychos. Like, that's what's writing in my. Notes. Well, based on they're about to have human heads oh, everywhere, God. too. Arrow plus human heads. <laughs> Arrow Wait, plus thank you. Human thank you, Jessica, for my notes. Okay. I know. I was torn up about the dogs, God too. damn it. Okay. And then we get to this next part, and I'm like, again, in the grand scheme of things. Um, so basically now it's okay. reign of terror time, but Russian style. So you know it's going to be hard. 
You know it's going to be metal. <laughs> turn the page. God damn it. Now I got to turn the page on my nose. Here we go. Because I wrote in big ass is why dog heads equals psychos arrow down plus human heads. <laughs> like, god damn it. That took up the whole fucking page. I think <sighs> Welcome everybody. Welcome back to body count. God bless America. <laughs> I think everybody now knows why it is I don't teach. Um, <laughs> this would be my notes in a 45-minute class, okay? Because remember, our podcasts go about an hour or so, whereas a you Except know a regular one, collegiate apparently. class, well, co- well, we we break it down. You know, we try our best. However, in a college class, it's like you got to boil that shit down into 45 minutes, two to three times a week for oh shit i thought i was gonna be smart and figure out how many weeks are in a year of college but i don't know that answer oh, let's not bring math into this like i got no, I, I immediately stopped but regardless okay you get the point <laughs> it's just like God. we got enough on our mind without math bethany okay god <laughs> Yeah, Roman Alvin are killing my mood with their psycho dog and human heads. Uh, so, Dang it. the terrible has now unleashed a complete reign of terror on the everywhere else portion of the entire country. But, you, what's he doing with his spare time at the old fortress, you ask? Probably not, but here's what he was doing. Knitting. Sipping lemonade on the porch and knitting. No? If, no? Okay. If <laughs> only. only. Um, uh-huh. he's, splitting uh-huh. his, <clears throat> he's splitting his spare time between just, you know, good old-fashioned killing. Whoever's brought to him or wanders by okay, and displeases killing? him. Just killing it up. And, okay, split between killing and... There are three things. Intense prayer. Oh, okay. In prayer. I know. It's an Question odd mark. juxtaposition next to mm-hmm. killing, but not as weird as what I'm fixing to follow up with, and fornicating to, like, Roman orgy proportions. So and he is praying. killing, then praying about it, then banging everything that moves, like, okay, rinse, repeat. So I, Yvonne, the the terrible or the great, the, the fourth, terrible, the fourth, fourth is the terrible. Is, the other okay. Yvonne has this, died long. Ago. I wrote this right. Okay, he died. Long ago. That's why yeah. I'm glad I wrote T E R. I knew I was right. Okay, Yvonne, the terrible, the fourth is split now between mass murder, killing, going into silent prayer. In mass orgies. Yes? Yeah, just pretty much banging whatever moves. Okay, cool. <laughs> I'm glad we are on the same arrows. Yeah. I am page. I, okay. And I know that's not a mix that we come across every day, not even in the pages of history. Can you imagine that Tinder profile? Like, enjoys <laughs> mass murder, days of praying, and bangs everything that moves. <laughs> Must be open to <laughs> click if only interested in <laughs> mass murder, intense days of praying, followed by watching me massive... bang everything, including you, that is around. <laughs> no matter the hole. <laughs> no matter the hole. Uh, and I, I doubt he was indiscriminate. He's pretty crazy at this point. <laughs> I mean, um, although, although, if you add, but I'm actually king to it, he would probably get the swipe right. <laughs> king, done. I don't need to read further. <laughs> exactly. So, before you criticize 1500 society, hold up a mirror to our own, folks. Look in the mirror before you judge, bitch. Keep <laughs> off in there Ooh. one way or in a lifetime, okay? Okay. <laughs> oh, Anywho, shit. despite all that, no one was safe because mm-hmm. this crazy effort had, like, gone off the deep end. 
for really and truly. Yeah. (laughs) And taking everybody with him into crazy town. So Yvonne also, the terrible, also becomes obsessed with the perceived fragility of the dynasty and he like that he's suddenly hell bent on establishing because he's only got the two sons remember and i mean it seemed as if only his son ivan yes i know that's at this point he's only going to be the terrible so it seemed as if only the terrible (sighs) son ivan would even make it to full adulthood as theodore oh shit congratulations Mm -hmm. Theodore Surprise. was not strong and more than a little Frodo. special. We don't know how. We don't know what the deal was. This is Frodo, but... right? Yes, this is Frodo. Okay, sorry. Sorry, this is how I'm trying to remember. Okay, I know it's not po- it's correct, historically correct, but this is how my mind is remembering. Okay. So, son of Ivan, the terrible the... the fourth, has this kid named uh, Yvonne and and Theodore Theodore aka is looking like he's he's a strong kid seems pretty with it he seems like he's doing good but now Theodore is showing signs of being a little different if that we're just going to call it that because we don't know they don't really record anything that you could draw a conclusion from Okay, hold on. I'm gonna put that in. But he, is, they're pretty sure he's not gonna make it to adulthood. Frodo, different. Yeah, yeah. So <laughs> I know what I mean. <laughs> with only one son instead of that, he views as a viable future czar. He gets it into his head that he just needs backups. Um, <laughs> oh Lord! <laughs> I wish. I wish it got less crazy. I wish it got better. But it's not gonna get better. <laughs> okay. Um, so one son sucks. Other sucks. is mentally sucks. Okay. Sucks. Make oh, more. Got it. Make listen, more. Make okay. more. <laughs> Plus babies. <laughs> So he becomes obsessed with marrying again. He's got to make them babies. Which so he needs a bridal. What was that thing called? A a bridal. Bride show. Thing? Okay. Bride, bride show. show. So Here he starts seeking actual European princesses this time to breed some uh-huh. like stock. He's and stepping also make up. Some, make some alliances on the continent. You know, I mean, it makes That's sense. But he's got a lot of messages to send. They're going to take months to get there because they travel by horse, you know. Oh, so, oh, oh sorry. <laughs> in the meantime, as he's sending said, all of these proposals out, which, you know, <laughs> that may take him five years to get all the way to England or some right, shit. Right. Who knows? Maybe it was just born, so it makes sense. She needs to grow up at least to 16. That's a viable age, so. You know, I mean... <sighs> Nine was a lot of work. Uh, they didn't yeah. really want to do, you know, whatever. So after that, yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's not the kind of fellow, as we know, to to wait. Um. So in the meantime, he goes through as many as eight wives. So suck on that, Shit. Henry the Eight. Like e- equals eight wives. Okay. Yeah, um, with at least three of those dying of suspected poisonings, and the oh, rest wait, were just married? murdered. He married what okay. is estimated as many wife. as eight women. Pretty and quick three succession. Died, quote, poison. Okay. Yeah, so, so three, but then all the rest were probably just murdered, probably at at the terrible's behest. So five murdered, quote unquote. Murder. So, um, in that case, you're you're definitely gonna want to like get prego right away. Clearly, <clears throat> like you better get your job. Like you, 
you, you remember how we were talking about Edward in our in-depth series about how poor me, I was born as a royalty. I have to produce children. Well, oh, oh, oh. this woman who ends up getting the attention of this czar better hurry up and put out not only children, but once again, it's a, it's a obviously hot topic of producing male children. I'm yeah. I'm good. The eyes of if we were looking at it now, I produced a male heir. You would die, bitch. Sorry, you produced nah. a woman. <laughs> Sorry, I win. Okay, I produced a male. But I'm just saying, I'm world makes you think there can't be empresses, Bethany. Because oh, we're gonna get to that. Okay. All right. We're All right. Hold on. Let me. Let me scratch this and move on with another arrow. <laughs> but not yet do. bitch we yeah. are not even through the before the Romanoff times oh. god bless America <laughs> <laughs> I'm even starting to like try to lose my voice and everything but we are going to finish this today by god like yeah. we're in it yeah. we're right. asking questions we're taking notes now yeah. kind of stepping Listen. back that was the overview when his second yes. wife died in 1569, a suspected poisoning, but who really effing knows at this point? Like, Ivan Quote went off. Him. Like, went off. Using it mm -hmm. as an excuse to just start purging <sighs> ministers. Um, and then those that he your didn't fault. just... It's your fault. Yeah. Those that he could get his hands on immediately that he didn't just purge. He hacked off the lucky survivors' noses and genitals. Okay. Fun uh, guy, right? Yeah. <laughs> and I'm sorry, but that tells me you've got something to hide, bitch. If you're going around whacking people, people's parts off, like, you may perceive this notion of, I care about her. Whack, 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 whack. No, you got something to hide, bitch. And you're lucky enough you have enough power to overrule me and take my fucking penis. God bless America. I think he's just absolutely insane, but, you know. It yes! Is what it is. Okay. Well, whatever. <laughs> so remember, a lot of people had already escaped to their own principalities and fiefdoms. So he just descends with the Oprichniki and has them go out to the principalities of all these magnates, and he murders virtually the entire Everyone? population okay. of these okay. areas of people he couldn't immediately get his hands on. Everyone. Okay. And let me I'm tell you, not. there are a lot of people <laughs> even then in Russia. So we're talking I mean, a lot of that's death. a lot of people. Yeah. Um, a lot. Um, 1.5 million. We're just going to aim high. There were about 14 <laughs> million, I believe, at that okay, time just in Russia. Kidding. I was trying to give a beneficial of the doubt. Okay, I was just trying. I'm not going to do Okay, so. Oh, my God. I'm sorry. I was just off the top of my head. We could both be completely wrong. <laughs> God, I'm sorry. <laughs> Whatever. Oh, okay. okay. <clears throat> so, get your notes ready. Because <laughs> while he's murdering virtually the entire population, he's, mm -hmm. he's also doing it in the most heinous ways imaginable. <laughs> Having his dog head <laughs> secret police people just go effing nuts. Um, things like treating vast numbers of these people to having like being dipped in boiling water and then freezing water like he's Japanese unit 731. I wonder if they were pissed off they didn't come up with it first. Probably. <laughs> uh, hanging vast numbers of people from hooks inserted through the rib cage, leaving them to die. Roping women and children together and shoving them under the ice kind of like crazy. Entire populations of vast areas doing all this, gone. It was absolutely insane. 
I'm at sorry, least but we that... know why he's the terrible for sure now. I mean, that makes Hitler look like a motherfucking bitch. Like a mama's bitch. Right? Like he gassed gas people. Gas. Really? <laughs> oh, Bethany, yeah. that's the worst thing I've ever said. <laughs> That's it. Really? That's the moment. That is the uh, worst thing we have said. Together as one. <laughs> oh, you gas people? Oh, that's Thinking cute. Thinking it identically. <laughs> that's oh, adorable. We are on government <laughs> lists now. Like, yeah. oh, God, that was terrible. Accept our fate, Jessica, and just pursue it further <laughs> okay. so while the terrible and again i want to stress since we had a little little incident about it earlier no one gets that name by accident no, no. this holds up in the never never like reign of terror <laughs> on his own country because dukes and boyers pissed him off and he's paranoid as fuck <clears throat> And remember, all these people he's killing, he's just thinking of it of, like, he's shooting the cattle of his enemies. So that's how yeah. horrible this, That's where we're at. That's this mental health sweetie, life. sweetie this is. This is where we are. Um, <laughs> so while he's reign of terroring it, something happens. <clears throat> I am losing my voice, but it's all right. We're almost at the end of all this craziness. A totter con, and let's not call them taters a totter con uh, okay fine just say con just say a con tk all right fine a tk, TK. A totter all right. con. whatever you TK. take the fun out of everything jessica right. oh, tk all right i've got it written down tk takes advantage of all this chaos that Takes. Yvonne is creating in his Yvonne is creating in his own kingdom, right? Mm-hmm. Well, and he, he it sacks the yeah. living shit out of <laughs> Moscow. Does so this. TK becomes K. Oh, all right, I got it. CK to K. This... <laughs> yeah, I mean, and again, he's a con. So these are the remnants of all the broken up tribes of Genghis Khan. And if anybody knows how to loot the shit out of something, it's a Mongol. So, right. Or, right. and I shouldn't Some say they're Mongol. Mongol. They're people of Turkish descent. <laughs> but it's also a totter. They were a big part of Genghis Khan's whole Tanger. army thing. Please go back, listen to the series. <laughs> anyway, knew how to sack the shit out of a place Genghis Khan style. Let's put it that way. Right. So like, yeah. And I almost feel bad because you've got to consider the 90% of Russia, so all the peasants that live in Moscow, all the peasants that live in these people, they cannot catch a break right now. Between poverty and famine and war and now all of a sudden abuse, right, basically? Well, just death. I think they bypass the abuse or the abuse is in conjunction with the death. But that's just the, the death, the the death, a death, my money, like debt. I cannot catch a break, these poor people. So, Yvonne the Terrible no break. calls back the Oprichniki after they finish up <laughs> and reunites Oprah's. his army. Like, he literally Oprah. let them Oprah's finish army. all their... <laughs> you. God damn Over you. Sorry. Comes in and saves the day. <laughs> See, no, but that's the thing about it. He lets them finish. He lets them finish all, all right. their sacking of his own country first. He's like, no, no, no. I mean, y'all are gonna die first. You're there. I'm they gonna be piss me off. Though. Like we'll deal with <laughs> Moscow in a, you know, I we'll deal with it in a minute. <laughs> so after they finish. Killing everybody. He calls them back and they reunite the entire Sardom. So take back Moscow and he looks, the whole kingdom back together. And he looks like a hero. Here, here. And then, <laughs> oh, then of all things, he abdicates the throne. What? And I really, I mean, this is what I mean by we don't know, like, WTF going on in this guy's head, right? And he advocates 
not to his son, which he was so worried about that started this whole yeah, thing that's anyway. Yeah, the whole reason why but we're here. Abdicates the throne to a Christian Totter Khan's son. So oh, that same that. one that sacked I'm Moscow, done. he I'm puts it all back podcast. together, then gives the throne <laughs> to the son of the guy who did this, right? Oh my the God. Crazy Just does not done. stop. Nope. You can't be done because it gets weirder. <laughs> it gets weirder. Oh, let me grab this towel. I'm throwing it. <laughs> he gives the throne away, lets him have it for a bit, and then wins it back. Literally oh, reclaims it Lord. by military Jesus force. Freaking Christ. Oh, of course. Here we go. Finally, military sneaks back in to the end of this podcast. Here so, we go. Welcome I mean, back. did he like <laughs> give it away to be like, I'm such a badass. I can literally just give this away. And then when I feel you like I take it back. You guys can't live without me. Watch. Okay. Uh, is he dancing up. around saying like, I'm, I'm uh, like herpes. You, uh, you got me for life. <laughs> I may not be inflamed, but I still have to take medication. <laughs> I'm sorry. But Yvonne the Terrible is the human equivalent oh, of herpes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. It is. I was just on to laugh. My tummy hurts so bad. <laughs> it's just, it's constant flare ups with this guy. <laughs> oh. Christopher, wait, oh, Kaleidos? I don't even say the right word. <laughs> like, I, I, I really Kaleidos? Do. I can't say it right. <laughs> I, can't I wish. Know. God damn it. Oh. I wish. This story got clearer as we go on. No, <laughs> but it gets more bad shit. Um, um, there's not <laughs> shit. Sorry, I cracked it out again. <laughs> but all of this absolute insanity. I mean, in I'm a weird what. <laughs> I'm not sure if I feel like I've learned something or just lost my mind further. <laughs> I'm not going to lie to you. <laughs> so are you going to have that same argument with me as earlier about needing a power center in this country? You'll get over it. <laughs> You'll get over it, bitch, okay? You'll get over it. I admitted you were right, but I wanted to get to that point. So you don't have to rub it in my gosh darn face. <laughs> Okay. Oh, I'm gonna do. Run it in your notes. <laughs> oh gosh, I'll never hear the end of it. I'm just saying. Just write in your notes. <sighs> Arrow. Jess was right. Okay, got it. Uh, God, I'm no. I'm not writing that down. You can put even J W R. J W was right. God bless America. I wrote it. And everything. I don't like it. This. I don't like God it. God bless you, Mary, gentlemen. Oh, I'm loving it. Okay. But as weird as all this crap was, and it was definitely not the way I would have gone about it, it did. Uh, it worked. The power it never goes of the way we want. <laughs> the power of every court magnate, whether they be prince, noble, boyer, was depleted. It, it was broken, and no one, including even the Romanov family, of the, you know, the uncle to the heirs apparent, were completely safe from Yvonne. He actually, he just looted family, friend, and foe alike. Yeah. But as bad shit, the way as he went about it, he broke all their power. Mm -hmm. uh, and then proved a pretty massive point. Oh, I'll just give away the throne to anybody I feel like won't be you. Ha, watch me and my badassery take it. I do what I want, bitch. <laughs> pretty much. He is the czar equivalent of I do what I want. End of story. <laughs> so I don't know if we, I don't, I, I just don't even know if it's a success 
or if it's just like a failure or brilliancy or geniusness it's <sighs> hard to tell but either way we got here because of you so it's cheers extremely <laughs> hard to tell <laughs> i don't even feel good about that. myself <laughs> I mean, <laughs> who am I kidding? I always feel good about myself, but I, mean, like, I don't even, I, I'm looking at this now and seeing this clearly was maybe not the story that everybody wanted to hear, but you know, no, I, no we needed to hear it. We needed to fully understand because it explains a lot about will Oh, Russia. Okay. Well, and where do this... we come from that preconceived notion of Oh, Russia. And okay. Not, well, but, uh, and why things even happen currently the way they do. But more importantly, mm -hmm. the sad thing is we're only halfway through the time of troubles after this next little bit. There Trump is more too. to follow. Trouble. There was trouble. The there was trouble. Is not part in. two. Oh, trouble. My God. trouble. Part two. <sighs> We're traveling our way in down the trail. Oh God! Okay. I was traveling out in Virginia, and I was making a fire pit. Here we go! Hallelujah! I Let think we home. we have <laughs> jumped the shark. We have yep. just completely we're Welcome. over it. That's all right because Welcome we only back. have one. We only have one paragraph left of this crap right here. So let's just, let's do it. Let's do it. <laughs> God, only one little set of notes left. So September 1580 sees a final bride show where the terrible marries once more. And this unfortunate winter winter chicken dinner does give him another son named Dimitri. So he's got a third son, but the first two, Anastasia Romanoff, the second one is not, right? Right, um, because all that matters is the sons in the first place. And we've got at least one, and Dimitri is the one we, re we, re we need. God. Yeah, we need Dimitri's, to remember. <laughs> yeah, if we okay, will. Sorry. A little, we will little, need little. to remember him. Sorry. So now he's kind of gotten what he wants, but mm -hmm. remember, let's just go ahead and flash back really quickly. The terrible has only well, one, a son of age, but he only has the one really strong heir of the correct age to you know like actually assume the throne and his name was of course Ivan by first wife Ivan. Anastasia Rome. God. So what well, we're now go ahead like Ivan the fifth? Yeah he would have been the fifth. And I say would have Hold been on. because we're getting to some fun stuff here. Okay Ivan the fifth, the fifth. Okay. God, Lord Jesus Almighty. All right. Going okay. On this generation. Except and that's for, where we're going to probably. Except for <laughs> the terrible flies into a psychotic rage in 1581 oh. and drives an iron tip staff into his son and heir's head. Oh, shit. Him. Psycho rage. So second rage kills air. How can you breathe with no air? Air. <laughs> you could have said anything else in the world. And I would have expected How? it more than that. I'm not supposed to breathe with no air. Air. <laughs> 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 that was a good one, Bethany. God. That was a really good one. <laughs> like that was a thing of beauty. I applaud you. I'm golf clapping right well, now. I wish uh, to your golf clap. I am ballerina bowing, curtsying, and, and matter of fact, well, silently. I am, 
I'm with throwing Dion the Ford. roses onto the stage. Oh, I am swooping them up, putting them to my chest as I bow and curtsy again. Thank you. Thank you as the curtain drops. Well, that's probably good because rose petals are quite slick. And if you like misstepped and slipped on one, that mm. ending would be like this whole fucking story thus far. <laughs> And this is why we do this podcast. Oh. <laughs> so, yeah. Oh, shoot. The terrible kills his own son and the only viable heir. So, his oh. final big act as czar, which left, which was to <sighs> kill this kid. And that only leaves his. <clears throat> Weak and feeble-minded second son by Anastasia. Theodore. Whatever. Theodore. Right? Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then little baby at this time, Dimitri, by wife number two. Yeah. To inherit. That's it. Oh. I always forget that he split. He split his first, the first one named Ivan. Or Yvonne was quote unquote murdered, and he had a, another one, Theodore, at, who I refer to as Frodo. But he's a bit touched and not really czar material. And right. then he's got that last kid by Next the second wife. wife. So he remarried, and now he's got another son. Except for then you've got the king baby problem. And which is so even if they bypass Theodore, you've got king baby, which puts us right just, back in the whole problem to begin with. So baby it ice tea. Now we're back to remember, you know, Yvonne. The terrible, or whatever. We're right back to baby it a baby iced tea. Yeah, he go. was a king circle. baby. Yeah, the circle of life. This yeah. is history. I'm gonna write it history. Except for like in this oh, history, one. the person holding the child up for everybody would to see would just like drop it over the drop edge it. for fun. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Oh, so after so all that crap, death. <laughs> exactly. No, exactly. So after all that oh, crap shit. he spewed and all those wives and all that junk about needing more heirs and, and really good ones Producing in case something happened to his an heir. son, Yvonne, yeah, yeah. he kills the boy. Yeah, because he already has Yvonne. He already produced two male heirs yeah one that was quote unquote special but he has Yvonne so what was so messed up with Yvonne that he had to shoot him well we'll club him with an iron quote unquote Nothing. yeah okay I mean we don't really know jealousy we just know that he went into the I'm assuming the boy said something did something he went this into psychotic rage take my crown Fuck you. I don't he care. He went into I a psychotic rage and killed the boy. <laughs> oh, fun. Okay, cool. For whatever this reason, is great I mother don't freaking know. story. Oh. It just gets better. So, thank God. And then at the same time, don't thank God because now we're in a state of double down chaos when Yvonne mm-hmm. the Terrible finally has the good grace to F and die in 1584. Oh, no. The last thing we need is a terrorist to fucking die. How horrible. <sighs> Except, um, let me write this down. We've already talked about quote, Russia needs a power center. Dies. Okay, hold on. Let me write this down. Psycho dies. Okay. Uh, <laughs> arrow. <laughs> I'm trying to make sense of all this, okay? So psycho dies. It's all right. It's all right. I'm I'm through it at this point. I have been taking questions. We are we are a questionnaire now. It's all okay. right. I'm into it. I'm just 
Okay, so Psycho trailing dies. everywhere for questions. Well, he dies. Who takes over? Who's now the? I know he. All right. He's well, not Yvonne, but is it Frodo? I mean, the I Theodore terrible is dead. So, yes, Nikita Romanov, who Who's was the, star? the brother of Anastasia Romanov and brother in law right. to the terrible. You remember him? Yes. He yes, does course. see to it that his nephew. Theodore ascends to the throne before he dies, right? His last act is to get the rather touched Theodore to be czar. At least he got that done. But then Nikita Romanov dies. And you're going to hate this part because we're about to have somebody with the same name. So we're going to have like same name problems again. So, nephew, like, nephew Theodore is on the throne, but the Romanov clan, after Nikita's death, falls into the hands of his eldest son, who is named Theodore Romanov. Now, why is Theodore Romanov really important? He's the father of the first and future Romanov czar. Now, remember, everyone is named the same damn thing in the story. We have told you guys multiple times. We apologize for it. It just is what it is, and we're going to have to make do. So. Exactly. I mean, hello, point blank. Get used to it. Here it is. Oh, I don't know what else to do about it. Like, we're, but at least Theodore Czar isn't going to be around that long, and Theodore Romanov's name gets changed for him. So that's going to make it less confusing, at least going into it. But like I said, this Theodore Romanov is the father of the first and future Romanov Czar. So obviously, there's going to be a lot more to follow. Um, We don't want there to be, but there is because the troubles are, oh, God help us, Bethany, only halfway over. (sighs) This is totally typical, but I'm here for it. I'm, I'm living for it. I'm all here for it. Like the death of Ivan the Terrible is really only the beginning of everything that is about to hit. And guys, I am so exhausted at this point, and I'm not normally glad to say this, but we're done. We are done with this week and this recording, and I am so thankful. Now. Yes. Amen. Amen, sister. Because it went so long and because there's been so much junk going on with it. And we're just now coming back, and it's like super, There's super so difficult to learn. Yeah, and, and we're just now getting back into this. I know we used to do our counterculture, and we're gonna get back into that. We promise. Um, yes, but we're still kind of in our own state of culture shock, essentially. And we're gonna get Amen. back to Patreon. <laughs> We're going to get back to Patreon. We're retooling everything that that we're going to do on there and looking at much different content that we want to put on there eventually. Life. We will get there. Life in general. Um, yeah. My family is still, like, picking some of their stuff out of piles, though, so I'm going to address that problem probably first before <laughs> I address Patreon. <laughs> Stuff up on the walls before we focus on Patreon. You know, (laughs) oh shoot, the rest of that. And we apologize. We really do apologize. Um, we just really need to get the the podcast up and running again. So we're just gonna cut it off. Social media plugs. Uh, so much love for Massive Late Fee. I mean, they're a great hey, podcast, and yes, we literally. Standing. Oh my God! Yes. We literally cannot function without Massive Late Fee, though. Um, and so that's at Massive Late Fee on big Twitter. Heads. Or I, Big I, Heads Media. Um, I cannot think of their Twitter handle off the top of my head. Big Heads Media at 
or big head yeah i'm pretty sure it's just that straight up big heads media at twitter or yeah is it okay well apparently i'm gonna take a second oh my god you bitch you do not just say that if I can yes, three at sentence. Big Heads Media. Oh, fuck that you, is Bethany is absolutely handle. right. Bethany is I absolutely right. I told you right. I'll pull I out my motherfucking Twitter. I will pull out my Google. I will pull out my media because guess what? We didn't grow up with that. And because it's available in my adult years, I'm going to take advantage. Thank you. And good we'll night. piss on you because I was going <laughs> to look it up in the encyclopedia. Ho. <laughs> <laughs> Oldie, <laughs> you're such an old ass. <laughs> oh God, I feel like we wanted to make everybody smarter, and we have just made both of ourselves dumber. Dumber after this. <laughs> no, I feel smarter. Fuck you, okay? Just because I make you feel dumb doesn't mean I can't feel smart. I did not say I yes, felt you did. dumb. You didn't say it, but you implied it. You were thinking it, okay? I did not imply it. You know, I just say it. <laughs> I think I should have used the term mentally exhausted. That is what I meant. <laughs> here, here. Amen. <laughs> holier than thou no, I don't know <laughs> oh my god you are I almost called you a word that I really shouldn't say on air um in record mode <laughs> oh my god I just looked it's written right there at Big Heads Media I wrote it down I know. Oh. Oh. <laughs> yeah. you wrote it down but I didn't believe you so I had to look it up <laughs> This is how much I trust you. <laughs> I mean, with good reason, though. With good reason. It's literally I've written right you. there on the page. I've known you over half my life, but even with what you write, I still am like, is she right? Is she? <laughs> You're a twatter. Speaking <laughs> of. I'd rather um, be a twatter than a tater. <laughs> than a tater. You know, a twatter con <laughs> or a tater con. Oh, welcome um, to Body Count Podcast. <laughs> professional all the way. Oh, uh, thanks. What, uh, am I, what do I do at the end of this stuff usually? I guess plug your social media. Okay, um, you can find me at Bethany Rose Skelton on Facebook, Bethany R N twenty four on Instagram, Bethany Skelton five on Twitter. Jessica, go. I am just at Jessica B Manor on Twitter and Instagram. You won't mm. find me on Facebook, not mm. even on my worst day. Um. <laughs> Let me think. What are the shows? We're just at Body Count Pod on Instagram yeah. and Twitter. I don't know if we have a Facebook. I think we do. Obviously, we do not care. Um, so that's that. Listen to us anywhere that you can stream and listen to podcasts. I, yes. I forgot how you close a show, clearly. So uh, it's been a while. Back. We will be back for more information on the Romanov. What's behind Bachelor number three? I think that we, I think by the end of this, we've gotten to Bachelor number one, Bachelor number two, and I think we're on to when we talk next. We'll be Bachelor number three. I'm pretty sure I've followed along in my notes. At least I've got number one and number two written down. So, well, you I'm know, keeping track. <laughs> number three has got to be better matters. than number two, which like Her fingers crossed, killing, intense praying, and orgy level fornication. <laughs> Orgies. So I think I think everybody else start. just got him beat. <laughs> I think we're doing okay. <laughs> as long as you draw oxygen and are not killing, you are already more of a qualified candidate. How am I supposed to breathe with no air? Air. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs>
laugh. That was so funny. I really did enjoy that. On that note, guys, we are out. We will see you next week with some more of the Russian time of troubles. Thank you so much for listening. We appreciate you. Love you. Bye. Love you. Bye.